Ever wonder how food commercials look so mouthwatering and perfect? These food shoots can cost hundreds of thousands of dollars, all so you'll buy more of these. Visual engineer Steve DeRolt shoots photos and videos for food and product-based commercials in New York City and around the world. I bring technology and kind of traditional image making processes together in what I call visual engineering. One piece of that technology, robots, or as they call them, motion controls. Steve's long list of clients include big brands like Hershey's, Budweiser, Pepsi, and Starbucks. Of course, making food look so good comes with a price. A single day TV shoot can cost between $50,000 to $100,000. In these food shoots that we create, we have a lot of moving parts. Uh, basically, You'll have, let's say, one item that's moving, something else that's splashing and running into it, um, something else that it's going to land on. We have to use a lot of different technologies and you know, synchronizing software to basically allow those things all to happen at the exact moment we need them to happen. Reloaded, here we go. Still pretty low. It also takes a symphony of people to make the products look the best they can be. Various stylists, engineers and operators work together to create the perfect shot. My name is Michelle Gatton and I am a food stylist. When I get recipes, I read over the recipes, I know what I'm going to be doing, so in the back of my head I start thinking about like how I'd like to do it. It's, it could change once we get on set with the different props, what the art director wants could change, but I start trying to create the recipe in my head because I'm only making it for pretty much the first time on set. I made these brownies yesterday just so we're not waiting on me making brownies and to make them look like I just made them, um, just warmed up the chocolate with a heat gun and I'm adding a little bit of melted chocolate to the cut side. So here we've got our uh, motorized slider, which, moving a, which is moving a pump that's gonna have caramel on it that'll be pumping down onto our brownies. So in the end, we'll have the shot of this beautiful ribbon of caramel kind of draping and curling on top of the brownie. There's a lot of trial and error. All right, and here we go. Yeah, nailed it. Every precise moment captured is nailed down to the millisecond. This is the benefit to using robots. Human hands are also used on commercials when timing is not a crucial factor. We put a lot of effort into the, these visuals. It's really cool to see your vision kind of come to life and be spread with the world. I think you have to have a really great understanding of what is appetizing. Everybody speaks the language of food. 